feeding time. Feed me more. Yo, welcome to feeding time. I am the big guy Ryback. It's a scorcher here in Vegas. I decided to come out, turn on the waterfall. I think some of my neighbors are up. Some are grilling over there. Some are in their backyard getting choked up, I think, and uh, I got the sun just glaring down at me. Monster workout, first day back in the gym. Feeling great, guys, feeling great. And uh, the cotton candy finish at BCAs. We're doing, uh, I'm hungry today. And I did. Somebody put it in the comments a while back. I saw something with the firehouse sub, the beef and brisket. And I have the beef and cheddar brisket. I haven't had that in so long. And I just said, you know what? I'm doing it, I'm doing it today. And uh, here it is. Just, just a giant foot long of meat. That's what she said. I'm not gonna waste any time, guys. Double meat on this beef, brisket, cheddar. I did 30 on the Stairmaster today. High interval training. If you can't do 30 minutes, guys, on the, on the Stairmaster, you think you have an opinion on, on me eating this beef and cheddar brisket in a negative way, go fuck yourselves. Okay? Okay. <laughs> and I did uh, shoulders and arms, some arms too. Ah. Hmm. I haven't had brisket in so long. Mm. Oh, fuck, it's so good. The beef brisket like melts in your mouth. They put the mushrooms on this? I got mushrooms. They didn't, they didn't put, I was supposed to get mushrooms. I paid a dollar for those, that bitch. Wait. No, there is mushrooms on this. They just weren't on any of the bites I had previously. I called her a bitch. On you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I was wrong. I take it back. I take it back. Food's really good, I close my eyes. I don't know what's wrong with me. It's like I go into a meditative trance of eating. Feed me more, what a hell of a fucking, it's amazing how I really ended up just being me. I just pictured me being old in a rocking chair, just eating a beef brisket cheddar sandwich, just rocking grandkids out there. Oh, crazy old Ryback. I tell you, this is this is a treat. I don't even care about the sun glaring in my eyes. I've been reading a lot of marketing books. And um, I always do. I'm trying, uh, 
starting to supplement, feed me more nutrition. There's so many aspects to business and sales are such a I, I, man of many hats. I've had to learn a lot of different skills throughout all of this. And uh, you can have the greatest product in the world, but if you can't sell it, you know, then what good is it? But I, I came across a really, 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 really amazing book. And one of the things I love about books, guys, I know, I'll shut the fuck up and eat in a second, is that books tend to lead you to other great books. And uh, learning never ends. But uh, And I did a commercial years ago that was out here by my pool, actually, before I got my palm trees. And it was the shittiest commercial in the world. And it was designed to be the shittiest commercial in the world where I clotheslined a, a heavy set woman into the pool. And my friend Nicole, who was a very fit girl that I knew from the gym, and a uh, beautiful girl, got out of the water. And uh, they looked nothing alike. But I essentially shell shocked the fat off of her. And I actually wanted to pick her up from the shell shock and do it in the pool, but my back was so bad. And, uh, I wasn't going to do that. <laughs> um, the, the lady, I just closed lined her to the pool and I took care of her and, uh, she was fine. Choked on a little water on the way down, but that was expected. She signed a waiver. Uh, but anyways, that was one of my best, uh, most profitable ads that I ever did. And a lot of people laughed at it. And, uh, but I knew at the time my intentions, what I was going for. But anyways, we're re we've revived that ad with my marketing team. With this, we're doing some going to do some outrageous marketing, and uh, yeah. So you may be seeing some pretty crazy feed me more nutrition stuff moving forward. A lot of meat. This is double meat. Yeah, what? Reminds me of a quote I put out. That uh, negativity and naysayers are like flies on shit. There's, there's always, there's an endless supply of them. They just keep coming. Swat them out of the way, block them. Keep on being great. Keep marching forward with passion and positivity, I believe I said it. It's like online. It drives people crazy when you block them most of the time. And then they'll have their friends try to like insult you like, oh, you're a snowflake for blocking. Doesn't work, buddy. Never will, never has, never will. That's the way you get back at them ultimately. And then they gotta go create another account if they wanna get another shot in, but usually they're too lazy. As always, with a uh, firehouse, you get a pickle. It's hot. 
been sitting in the sun, but it's still good. Done. All right. The uh, firehouse beef brisket, be, uh, beef and cheddar brisket, double meat on wheat with mushrooms. Five stars. Two thumbs up, five stars. This was a no brainer. That was as good of a meal as I'm a very generous re food reviewer as well. I, I, all food tend to make, tends to make me happy. So there you have it, guys. <clears throat> That's it. There's nothing else to say. Thank you for watching Feeding Time here on Feed Me More TV. Subscribe to my other channel on Ryback TV for all podcast content. Feed Me More Nutrition on FeedMeMore.com and Amazon. Be more. Feed me more. Yo, thank you guys for watching Ryback TV. If you could check out my Shooting Blanks Wrestling Report every Monday on all podcast platforms, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback every Thursday morning on all podcast platforms, and Feed Me More Nutrition, my personal supplement line, available on feedmemore.com and Amazon. Save 10% with discount code YouTube10 and save stupid. Why couldn't you? Almost had it. I almost had the whole video done in one take. Ah. <sighs> New customers, you can save 20% with discount code NEWCUSTOMER on feedmemore.com. Get hungry, stay hungry, feed me more.